Hi, I'm Storm Tracker 18 meteorologist Justin Esterly. Thanks for clicking on the video. A lot of severe weather came through last night, mainly in the form of tornadoes. Here's one picture from Jim Ivory Photography. He sent in to us, let us use his pictures. He's got a couple of them showing a tornado on the north side of Eau Claire between Chippewa Falls and Eau Claire. If you have any pictures, please send us those our way. We like to see them. We like to pass them along to the National Weather Service for their survey damage information and something they can put in with all of that information and the graphics that they choose. We had a couple of different tornadoes. One in Kadat was already confirmed, waiting for the National Weather Service to survey that. Later on this Wednesday morning, they'll likely have an update for us coming in later this evening. The rest of the area, though, we saw a couple more confirmed tornadoes or at least spotted tornadoes, things the National Weather Service is going to have to work out and decipher using surveys and radar. We'll keep those updates on our website coming up later on today. 75 for your forecast high, less humid though, partly to mostly cloudy, starting cloudy, eventually getting some breaks in there, but we will be seeing a much more comfortable day today. Temperatures drop towards 57 with some patchy fog and partly cloudy skies overnight. Patchy fog possible. We'll see if it forms. If it doesn't, it'll be a pretty clear start for your Thursday morning. We will be seeing plenty of hotter temperatures though as we get into the weekend. 81 for Thursday and a little humid. Then we go into the upper 80s to low 90s into the weekend with more thunderstorm chances. All of that goes back towards about normal as we head into next week.